recording that one. Where's my face? Oh, my face is gone. Okay, so then how are we going to say it, guys? As far as... Oh, city? Same. Because we're going to be looking this way now. So... It doesn't really matter. So I think... I mean, if we... Does yours... If yours gets this board, then we'll be okay. Because I need, like, the, the view of this board, and I need the view of this board. Sure. <laughs> Only now we're just not on the screen, though. So, scoot forward. <laughs> I just don't see it now. You don't see how that's going to work? Here. I'm just going to scoot you guys around. Okay. So, you're okay there. You can scoot back a tiny <laughs> bit. Actually, you know, you scoot further back. <laughs> you know, you see me. <laughs> and scoot closer to him. Now you can see him. You scoot t a tiny bit forward. You stay where you are. You scoot forward, and you scoot forward. Okay. There. So now scoot in, and you're okay. Ish. I do realize when we stand up to write on the board, it's going to disappear. I must say, my chair does not move. Your chair does not move. Like, uh, let's do it. <laughs> okay. We're doing the real thing. There's no nose taking or anything. Are I doing the nose taking? No. <laughs> oh. Sorry. Actually, I'm not even gonna bother with that. Okay. So for today's, where am I in screen? Ha ha. I need to get things. So I guess you don't need that. You just need that. There. Okay. I don't like the way this is set up, but whatever. Because now I feel like I'm not even looking at you guys. Anyways, so good morning, class. Good morning, good morning teacher. <laughs> so for today's topic, we're going to be talking about the top 10 uh, California commodities. So first off, what do you think a commodity is? I think it's like a, a raw material. A raw material, okay. Um, it's, I believe it's a, a raw material, yes, that can be, like, sold and grown to uh, connect it to agriculture somehow. Okay, good. Uh, anything to add, Alex? I think it's, uh, a raw material. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so for today's objective, I want you guys to be able to teach each other, your peers, about the commodity locations within California and the ranking of California's top 10 ag commodities. So now that we know what a commodity is, I want you guys to start brainstorming them. Uh, talk to each other. Uh, and why don't you fill out this list of the top 10 ag commodities and tell me what you think ranks from 1 to 10. Anything. Whatever you think a commodity is. So I think one should be like milk, because I lived in Tulare for a little bit. There's some cows there. Commodity is not counting. You know what, Professor? Milk. We got it. We gotta have tomatoes on the list somewhere. Yeah. About grapes. <laughs> Almond? That's a good guess. That's a very good guess. Uh, what <laughs> else can you go on there? Huh? I need corn. Corn? I got corn somewhere. How about strawberries? Strawberries? <laughs> uh, wait, that's two R's. That's right. T E R R I E S. <laughs> Why do you think cattle are a commodity? Um, I mean, we said it could be anything that can be produced and sold. So I know that cows are sold. Good. Okay. What else? I like cotton. Okay, cotton. cotton. What else? Um, how about <laughs> chicken? Okay, chicken. What about number four? Walnuts. All right. So, looking at your list, why do you think your why 
why did you choose these commodities? Where do you think they're grown, and why do you think those are the right choices? Think about how big California is and how many acres of these you've seen. Well, I think one of the main reasons he had milk on there was every time you drive up and down the 99, you see a lot of uh, cattle ranches and cow farms and stuff, so okay. milk is a pretty big commodity. Is there a difference between the ones you see? Do you see, like, is, do you think there's a difference between, like, ones that's just for the calf, the cattle, and you think there's one just for the milk cows, or do you think that they're just the same thing? I think they're different, the black and white ones are for the milk, and I've seen all the commercials for Happier Cows in California. Okay. I hear Happy Milk, no, Happy Cows, come. milk comes from Happy Cows. Okay, alright, so here what we're going to look at is the <laughs> top 10 list, and Tyler, you were right, the top two commodities are milk and almonds. Why do you th and you think that is because of all of the dairy cattle that you've seen around the valley. Mm -hmm. How about almonds? Where are almonds originally from? Mediterranean? Right. So if they're originally from the Mediterranean, how are they our number two commodity? Our climate matches up with the Mediterranean climate. Right. Um, Want to know a little fun fact about almonds? While they're originally produced and grown in the Mediterranean, their climate and their eco economy couldn't quite support the, the quantity that everyone wanted. So Cal they came to California, and California took those over, and that now there are n we're the number one world producer of almonds, while the Mediterranean, where they're originally from, is a lot lower down the list. So let's keep going. How about grapes? Do you think it's talking about wine grapes like in Napa, or table grapes like in Fresno? Table grapes. Table grapes, okay. I think it's talking about grapes in general because when you drive around the valley or if you're driving around just the state of California, what do you always see other than cows and grass? Grape vines. Right. So you see all kinds of vineyards and things like that. Um, David, what do you think of, about the about the nursery one? What do you think that means? Mm, as far as greenery or plants, um, herbs and stuff. Okay, so think about where you would buy nursery products. What, what do they sell there? Like if you go into the nursery department of Target, Home Depot, Lowe's, what do you think, like what do they have? Lots of flowers. Flowers, plants, things like that. Those are things that are grown that you're going to take from there and buy and plant in your garden. So that pretty much sums up what we're talking about with the top 10 commodities. Um, in small groups, I want you guys to talk to each other and write about why you think California is the top producing state and more about the cattle, berries, hay, lettuce, and walnuts and tomatoes. <coughs> okay? Is and one paragraph enough? Yes, one paragraph is enough as long as it's well thought out. Okay, you're good.